superhero body? It doesn't matter. Yeah, it does. That's super, there are, Name a superhero that looks like you. Um, Toad from X Men. <laughs> In terms of culture impact, impact. Impact. Endgame or Borat? <laughs> Borat. Yes, Borat. What's quoted more? One hundred percent. My wife. Who quotes Avengers? Give me one quote line from Avengers Endgame. Let's go, go in the building. <laughs> <laughs> that was in it, right? Yeah. Ah, when they got shot. Oh, ah, was yeah, it? Yeah, ah, yeah, was yeah, good. Yeah, Let's yeah, go yeah, in the yeah, building. Yeah. There are, there's, you know, there, there are superheroes you're not even aware of. Dead girl. You know who that is? No, but I She's guess dead. I, I can put it together what she is. Yeah. She's dead, so you can't kill her. Nobody wants to watch that. I'm just telling you that they exist. Nobody wants to watch a superhero that can't. There's a Japanese X-Men called Sunfire. Sunfire. They, they don't say it like Sunfire. that. Koreans ever have slaves? I want to know. That's insane that you, why would you even Google that? The, 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 Google's not going to even know that. Slavery in Korea. South Korea, media reports the abuse and exploitation of people with disabilities on rural islands. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. Salt farms in Sinan County. Wait, on rural islands, they, 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 they in use in 20, yes, so you guys exploited disabled people on rural island salt farms in Sinan County and yeah. described as slavery. Hey, so no arms, pick up that you. salt! Fuck you. You guys handicap. look at this. You guys exploited disabled people in salt farms in Sinan County, and that's in 2015, five years ago. So yeah, you had slaves. You got them still. You take mentally challenged people and you make them work in the salt farms. What else are they going to do? We do it here at McDonald's. <laughs> right here at McDonald's, the fry guy. That's not slavery. They pay him. Oh, they do. Yes, they pay those guys. <laughs> oh, you know what BTS is? Uh, behind the sh no, no, behind the it's shield. A, it's a huge, the biggest pop group on earth. I know who they are. Yeah, yeah. I know ATS. who they are. A a a F a T F. <laughs> no, 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 no. Those are the ones that killed the people in uh, Waco. <laughs> <laughs> That's what ATF is. Wait, BTS, this is them. Yeah, the biggest boy band in the world. The in biggest K pop band in the literally world. in the yeah. world. And yeah. they are all. Look at how. Look, that's a. Are these all boys? Yeah. That's uh, a girl. Yeah. That's a hot boy. Yeah. I would I, fuck every one of them in their buttholes. Can I tell you the one that I wouldn't? This what? one. Which I don't one? like his look. This no, one that right was here. the one. Yeah. That was the one that like barely got in. He, that didn't even he want auditioned him. 50 times. <laughs> uh, we need somebody. <laughs> how about Ogoro? <laughs> And they're like, we don't, he can't dance, sing nothing. You know what I mean? But he'll just be in the background. He's in the background. Look at yeah, this. Yeah, they don't him. even tell him where the camera is. He's, yeah, look, yeah, he's yeah. looking yeah. this way. Like they don't even, he just, he, you know, he finds out from the other guys when the photo shoots are. Yeah, yeah. They, they don't he, call him directly. No, he has to get text. Yeah. Taco, Taco, Taco Tanaka. Tanaka. Taco Tanaka. Goes, Tanaka. goes, yeah, yeah, Wingo. <laughs> That's the name is Wingo. <laughs> yeah, Wingo. We have a photo shoot right now. They didn't tell me, <laughs> right? And he has to run. They won't even. They won't, they won't even pick him up. Mm -mm. Uh, he has to run with his little yellow legs. Yeah, yeah. I'm here, guy. Oh, look, look. But yeah, yeah. he might be blind. <laughs> yeah, they're all looking blind. at the camera. He's well, blind. they're Asian. That's rude. Oh no, 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 yeah, no, no. no. Yeah, You're yeah, right, man. He's yeah, looking uh, the wrong don't way. Don't do eye jokes now. But my friend, I wasn't. Yeah, I know. Um, so oh, just oh, here we go. Clockwise from left. Here's their names. Okay. One's just named the letter V. <laughs> <laughs> really? Yeah, Kim yeah. Tae Hyung. Also known by his stage name V. Yeah. yeah and yeah. then who do we got left? We John, have five more. John Cook. Yeah, John Cook. Oh, Ooh, that's a that's a villain in a movie, huh? That could be. That was like you when you were a little boy. That looks like you. Maybe he's the type of guy that like at a party he comes out naked and they think that he's doing the um, Buffalo Bill thing where he's tucking his dick around. Yeah, the, the man giant. And people are like, "Stop doing that." He's like, "I'm not doing it." <laughs> <laughs> she finds a lot of joy in these young little Korean boys. What's wrong with that? Because she says shit like, how come you don't look like this? <laughs> you know what I mean? You know when she says that? Yeah. Hold up a mirror to her. Yeah. And just go, this Well, is actually, why. my mom, if you, why. if you look at my mom- Actually, in, your mom is act in her In her 40s and attractive. 30s and stuff, she was hot as fuck. I know. And your dad was- Ugly. A shoe. Your father looked like- the, uh, My dad was like, you know, they laid him down on his back, and they just said, <laughs> run over nine steamrollers over his face, like the big construction kind. <laughs> That's what my dad looked I like. Thought, you, know, you still have zits. I don't have any zits on my face. That's okay, crazy. well, it looks like it. It you looks like red, it. You, whole, your whole head looks like a fucking boil. This is just red. It's this a is red boil that they pop and a juice is Your whole come head, up. your whole head. Yeah. Looks like, a, like you know the lemon head guy? That's what you look like. Oh, the yellow lemon that's, head guy. That's delicious. Look at this. 
Oh, <laughs> oh, that's a racist. I'm Bobby Lee. No, oh, Lemonhead. Yeah, I'm yeah, saying yeah, Lemonhead. Yeah, yeah. The candy. Yeah, this is you. Hey, <laughs> I'm Andrew Santino, and I'm going to have a co- child, and I'm going to have that rage. In fact, the owner, the reason why I can get a table there, he's a huge fan of Kirby Enthusiasm. Oh, he is? Yeah, every time I go in there, hey, he says my character's name and everything. What was your character's name? I forget. Bong Joon-ho? <laughs> Bong Ju- No, don't, 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 don't. If you fucking do don't, a Bong Ju, don't, Bong Ju don't, again. Don't, don't, don't point it at my don't fucking face. Don't fucking say that. Okay. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> you and I, let's say you and I are playing a plane crash. We're the only survivors. We, you and I end up on a deserted island. Okay. You wouldn't want, I would be the last person you'd want there. Why? Because I would have to save I'd you? I'd go tribal real quick. You'd try to kill me. Yeah. It, like as soon as we got on the beach. You'd look up. I'd be completely naked with a spear, trying to and kill. I'd, I'd have like like some sort of like makeup on my face, and be like, hu, do, do, hu, do, 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 and I'd just be, be speak the tribal. language immediately. Yeah, immediately. Yeah. Wow. Hu, do, do, hu, do, hu. Already... So you would kill me? You think you'd kill me? My whole thing is, I, I think. See, my scenario is, we crash on an island. I'm. I have to gather and collect everything because you're laying down. You're. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. You're yeah, finding yeah. a way to play Candy Crush on the sand. Yeah, in no, the no. sand. Shit. See, after two days of no water and you not doing anything to try to get food for us, yeah. I would have one of those nightmares in the middle of the night where I grab a coconut and I smash it over your head. Because I think he's got protein. I can eat him without a doubt. See, I knew that I would know that about you. So That's you why try to I kill would me already first. pre. Huh. Yeah, yeah. I'd already have the spear ready to go. Really? Right up front. But the moment I, I die, are you going to try to eat me? I'd probably fuck you first. Fuck me and then right eat me? Right when the body is warm. Yeah. You know what I mean? Still warm. So you'd fuck me? Because I, I probably won't have a warm hole for a very long time. I can promise you that when I kill you, I won't eat you. Or I won't fuck you. Yeah. Oh, really? I wouldn't fuck you. Would it be funny if I fucked you, ate you, and then I walked across to the island as a resort? <laughs> <laughs> and I'm just in Hawaii. <laughs> You think you're like, oh, enough? shit, my bad. You're just in Maui? Yeah, I'm in Maui. Yeah. And then they're like, why is that naked guy with the spear with the makeup? Blood thing? dripping from yeah, your yeah, mouth? Yeah. And just like, yeah. Why does he, have, little, why does he have red hairs in his teeth? <laughs> Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. And his dick is out. His yeah. Dick, what? What, what I would happened? probably do then, in that case, I would be like, I would probably, I would say, I, the plane crash. And I was on the beach alone. And they go, but you didn't see the lights from the resort right over the hill. Yeah, but I, you know, they're like, well, is there any other survivors? I'd be, like, no. There's no other survivors. No, 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 no. How come there's blood all over you? Did it's you, my own blood. Let me see. You don't have any cuts on you at all. Internal bleeding. It's coming out? Internal blood is yeah, coming out? Yeah, I need out? to go to the hospital. Okay, we'll take it to the hospital. Yeah. All right, and okay. then they're like, why is your dick sh- with shit on it? Why does your dick have poop all over <laughs> it? Because <laughs> uh, I, I, I have uh, reverse Crohn's. Oh, it comes out. I would like make up a disease. Reverse Crohn's. I have Crohn's. reverse Crohn's. Right. And, they'd, and the doctors, of course, would go, right, we've heard of reverse Crohn's. <laughs> That's when poop comes out of your pee-pee. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I go, what? And he goes, Poway High School, dude. Hall of Fame. You're not on it. Go Poway High um, Hall of Fame. Google that. Poway High Hall of Fame. A Hall of Fame? Yeah. Poway Poway High School Hall of Fame. Right there, the first one. I don't need the. I don't need go the down. Scroll down. I don't need all that. Bullshit. Okay, here we go. Oh, now these are the names. Yeah. Okay. Wow. Okay. So um, now you you now uh, make, let, let's make an argument. Sure. All right? Do you think that they're more famous than me? Um, you're not famous enough to be in this. And I will say that that's true. Cause to, look at Tina Guo. She yeah. just got in from a class of 04. Yeah. Everybody knows T. <laughs> you don't know T-Dog? Tina Guo is an internationally renowned cellist being honored for her accomplishments in the arts. Grammy nominee. Uh, partner with Bentley Motors and the Ritz-Carlton Classical Electrical Cellist. <laughs> See, how what? famous is Tina Guo, by the way? Okay, but I... W- Tina, you're, hold on. You're, you're supposed to be on my side, dude. I am and I on your like side. I feel like you're like on that fucking board. There's no way I'm on that board. This week we have a meeting. <laughs> what food won't you eat? I don't eat a lot of foods. I'm a picky eater. Yeah, I can tell. I, I can tell. He's I, got I, that I, look, fucking Mal picky Nutri- white eater guy. Uh, yeah, thing. yeah. Look, let me ask you something. Yeah. Would you eat um, fried butterfly wings? <laughs> <laughs> That's a good question. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I wouldn't want to. Like, uh, I would prefer not to. Like, if I was, I would. Are you a meat eater? I don't eat red meat. How about right. this? So but I, you eat you white meat. I I eat like chicken and turkey. Yeah. How about this? Yeah. So the, yeah. I'm at a restaurant. I'm a waiter. I put down a nice plate of sautéed monkey farts. Yes. You would eat it. No. Uh, what region are they from? Right. A Papua New Guinea. Oh my God! You're not gonna eat that? <laughs> I'll eat that. Pass it my Papua way. Papua New Guinea has the best. 
Fried monkey, monkey farts? Yeah. Oh they have the best. Delicious. Sauteed. Oh. <gasps> Sauteed monkey farts. Not fried. A little bit of garlic. Yeah, yeah. I would eat it because I feel bad that it's going to waste. Like the monkey farts just died. Oh, you're a preservation guy. Yeah, yeah. Oh, There's like probably not a lot of food there. Can I guess what your favorite <laughs> meal is? It doesn't yeah. seem solid. Your favorite meal? Yeah. I want to say pizza for some reason. You feel like you like no, pizza. Mac and cheese. Mac and cheese. I never liked mac and cheese. I, I get the I get the vibe why you. You get that. never liked, liked mac, mac and cheese. And cheese. That's an insane. Yeah. That's a like claim I don't think I've ever heard a human say before. Porridge. Oh. <gasps> no, I don't. A little I don't, porridge you're boy. You're a porridge boy. Dude. Are you a pot pie guy? No, I don't like those consistencies. Well, oh, so you give, give me consist, consistency and I'll tell you what you eat. Beans. That's it. Okay. <laughs> Wait a minute. <laughs> Do you just eat beans? Yeah, big. I don't like beans. You don't like beans? No. No, give me consistency you like, and then we're going to try to guess. I mean, it's not like all I eat, but like, I guess like- uh, You're a big Chick-fil-A guy, aren't you? Yeah, see, I got uh, it. Did I get it? Chick I got it. Fuck, Chick-fil-A? Chick it only took me a few. What? Did you see in my car? I didn't look at no, your car to know where you parked. That was a my, natural guess. You do my look- Chick-fil-A bit? I have a bit about Chick-fil-A. Oh, really? Really. Let's not hear it. No, I don't want to- I'm not- I don't want to hear it. The waffle fries? They got you. Well, I like how that. many chicken. How many, how many little nugs are we getting? What pack? Twenty. They're all good. By I'm usually if I'm driving, I would get the sandwich because I'm driving. A Sammy drive. If I'm okay. not driving, the strips. Mm. Ooh. But then the nuggets are probably the most delicious. So I understand you have a childlike appetite. Sure, but I've I've gotten better at it though. Like I can go to on dinner with a lovely lady or a business thing, and I can pretend I don't want fish sticks. Will you push around the salad though? You're not going to eat the salad. I don't love salad. Dressing. I know. I can tell you. Don't I'm a beautiful that. woman. I meet you online. You you broke up with your girl from Atlanta. Yeah. I, I'm a Japanese. <laughs> What's your name? Tiko. Oh. <gasps> Tiko. Tamia. Konnichiwa. No, Tiko. T -I -K -O. Tiko Tamia. Yeah, Tiko Tamia. <laughs> You're half Japanese. No. I don't think Tiko is a name. No, it's my internet name. Oh, okay. I'm an influencer. <laughs> First Tamiya. of all, dude, let's not disrespect Tiko Tamia. Yeah, yeah, yeah. She's pretty well known. I right, go menisai. That's I'm sorry. Yeah, I don't know that. I'm. Oh, you're American. I'm an American. I respect. I'm so sorry for assuming that you should speak a language. I anyway, <laughs> anyway, <laughs> anyway, Tewa. <laughs> anyway, Tewa. You have the accent though, even though you're born in San Diego. She's an influencer, dude. I'm an influencer, dude. All right. Yeah. And I, you know, I hawk um, seaweed snacks. Yes. On my um, TikTok. Yes. So anyway, um, where are we eating? What restaurant are you gonna take me? Well, no, when you do that, let me say something. I love that noise. Yeah. You did that with the waffle fries and the fucking chicken sandwiches, right? Um, yeah. Is that the noise your penis made when you kissed Heidi Klum? <laughs> it may. I did you get hard? Correctly. No. Okay. No. So anyway, was, back to me. Respect to her though. Like, what's my name again? Uh, Tico. What's my last name? Tico Tamai. <laughs> Komai. Tico Komai. Anyway, where are we eating? <laughs> um. I'm I'm not sure. I'm like I. Will you wait, make reservations? I, it's like I take you maybe like a nice uh, vegan Thai food restaurant. Interesting. I saw I saw I saw Ed Begley Jr. there once. <laughs> so. I... Okay. <laughs> Ed Begley Jr. Yeah. That's a good one. That is good. Yeah. I love him. So I met him once. He's super vegan, sweet. So a vegan Thai joint. May, maybe. I mean, I'm not vegan, but like somewhere interesting conversation. But have you been there before? Yeah, I scope it out. You know? Now, have you eaten there before? Yeah. Is it good? Yeah. Okay. Where's it at? I'm not looking to plug this. I mean, there's one in the, in the Studio City area. Okay. You should go. Do you think that's a good date? No. This sounds like a bad date. Yeah, I don't yeah. like it. You're not. Okay. What do we do afterwards? You know, um, I don't know. Like, I've been in the relationship thing. I'm just trying to think of a single life. What do you do? Like, maybe. I don't know. You go to a bar like, down the street. This Ventura, what bar? Ventura has a lot of bars. Tico, you're sober. Yeah, I'm sober. <laughs> Maybe I, I say good night and like, cause I'm not in a hurry. I'm an older guy now. Like, I'm like, I'm like, I have a dog to go home. I want to smash. Home. Then maybe I go listen. Let's. I want to. Where are we gonna smash? I have a dog now, so I don't know. I mean, I've had. A, I guess I go. <laughs> we, Man, I hope I, you. I, I hope you stay in this relationship. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. No, <laughs> no, no. Can I tell you? So wait, wait. I'm so I, this is gonna be tough. I don't even know where to, where to start. Like, where do you start? Like, I, I would say come to my place. No, you're talking to me, so don't go. Yeah, so so, so where are we gonna go? I would say Tico, I've had a great uh, well, dinner. After dinner, so dinner checks paid. We're staring at each other. Are you paying? Are you staring at me? Are you paying? Yeah. Oh, thank you for paying. Yeah. Where are we going? Well, we where are we gonna smash? Oh God, Tico, look how much he tipped. Sixteen <laughs> percent. Oh, wow, that's pretty. You know when you, when I saw that? <laughs> <laughs> a little juice. Got wet? Yeah, a little so bit. Tipped a slightly over. Yeah, sixteen. <laughs> she she likes it when I you're, love when it. you're a bad boy. Yeah. It's bad boy. And are you telling me that? 
No. no. You can hear it. You have you have hearing, I right? I have poor hearing. I had, what do you think that is when I hear, you hear that? I had a tumor as a child, and I can't hear in this ear. Been, Are you being serious? Yeah. You can't hear out of your left ear I that well? very poor hearing in my left ear. I Where was the tumor? <laughs> He laughs at the, at the, <laughs> the sad parts of it. It's just life. so sad. When I'm sad. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Goes, yeah. This is great. You have a tumor there now? Uh, the tumor's been removed. But I have a titanium thing that allows me to hear. That oh, so you can't hear. I can't hear whispers. Have you whispered sweet? All right, so you don't hear it. What if I say it? So I go, and then I know you didn't hear it. I go, well, I just, <laughs> my vagina just made a noise. But can I ask a question on this? No, go ask, ask I me. Like to, ask me, ask me. Uh, Kiko. Kiko. Ma'am, are you? Was it attractive to you that I tipped so little, or that it's a lot to you? Which part was hot to you? Well, you know, usually guys try to impress, yeah, and they'll they'll pay like you know. I dated Bobby Lee once. That guy, he tips he, like thirty percent. Yeah, thirty percent, and it's like too much. It's like me. Look at my big dick, yeah, yeah. right? And he has one. Yeah, that's why he True. does stuff like that. right. Excuse me. I I, I don't. Excuse me. <laughs> he does. We're talking about Bobby Lee. Yes, the comedian, big dick. Okay. I'm happy to hear it. I heard. Yeah. I, I, what'd you hear? What'd you hear? I'm just gonna tell you what I heard. I wrote it down. You no, know, no. What'd you hear? Really? I'm telling you what. This is true. Yeah. So uh, we did a photo shoot. Me and Betty with Jen Rosenstein today. The yeah. photographer. Yeah. Love Jen Rosenstein. Uh -huh. And she told me to say, because uh, I told you I was worried you're gonna be mean to me, like you, you told me you would be. Yeah. And she says for me to tell you, be nice to Taylor, or his dog is gonna bite off your tiny pee pee. Hmm. She's not a comedy writer, is she? I'm just, I didn't. You know who she's married to, right? Yeah. My ex-girlfriend. Yeah. <laughs> but I, I that's, a, that's a bad shot. Oh, no, 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 no. Don't, don't, don't. I'm calling Jet. All right, call her up. I'm going to call her. <laughs> call her up. That's fucked up. No, I want you to call her up. Are we done with the role play, though? No, we're not done. Okay. Please. <laughs> no, we're going back. Are we her. done with the I, role yeah, yeah. play? You're I just getting started, baby. I assume yeah. it's large. I don't like stereotypes, you know? <laughs> Hi, Bobby. Hey, Sarah. How are you? I'm good. How are you? So, you know who Taylor, Taylor Williamson is? I do. So, yeah. we're having him on the pod right now, me and Andrew. He's on the show right He's now. on the show right now. <laughs> so are you. Hey, so are you. Hi. So, um, your <laughs> yes. wife yes. wrote a letter to me claiming that I have a small penis. A tiny pee pee. Okay. A tiny pee pee. Okay. So, what the <laughs> fuck is going on around here? What did she write? A, she wrote a letter. It was I. I dict, she dictated it. She to me. dictated it to down. Taylor and says that if. Would you, well, tell me exactly what he said. I'm gonna. Um, she said for me to tell Bobby, be nice to Taylor, or his dog is gonna bite, bite off your tiny pee pee. It's gonna bite off my tiny pee pee. <laughs> now, let, it's, it's very interesting. Um, yeah. are you telling your wife that I have a tiny pee pee? No. No, we've never talked about your genitalia, my love. Ever. Let's talk about it. Yeah, yeah. So you've seen my genitalia, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're good. Awesome. I'm good. You're Thank good. you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Don't yeah, yeah. That. Listen. Yeah. Listen. Listen. You know, I have, and I have complete. We are not. We don't function the same. That is her own autonomous opinion based on whatever is going on. She told me that story when she got home. That she told Taylor to say that to you i was like did you really and she's like yeah i was like okay well, okay well I, you know yeah. I, she needs consequences <laughs> well, no, 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 yeah, yeah 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 she needs consequences or there's gonna be a problem between I, you and i there needs bobby. to be consequences she needs to be reprimanded bobby where's jen at she, she's not here okay she's not here. i need consequences i'll talk to you soon all right love you i love Goodbye. you bye bye guy puts the hammer down that's great, and I. I'm way, Tico. Tico back. By the way, she Tico's back. Tico's back. <laughs> Tico's back in the scene. Tico, please tell Bobby that ba my dog also won't bite off. Anyway, anyway, we're not talking about Bobby Lee. Man, what I want to say yes. is, we're gonna go to your place and we're gonna smash. Sure. Okay. Yeah. Tico, is this a first date, by the way, Tico? Well, you would know, right? Have I, have I met you before this? Right. 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 So then, ding dong, it yeah. would be our first fucking date, right? Yeah. He must be dating a lot of Asian girls. Yeah. How many fucking... <laughs> he just looks so much like Anyway, other... Anyway, we're going to yeah. go to your house and smash. Okay. No condom. I can't. You can't wear condom? I, I can't do no condom. Wait, stop. Can we, can, I want to break out a character real quick. Go ahead. May I? Yeah. Why not? <laughs> If I was in a monogamous thing, I would be. So happy. you've you how many times have you won a condom? Every time? 
No, in I mean, in my relationship, I have never not. Oh, I mean, we were the beginning. I mean, <laughs> I, 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 I'm not. I'm not gonna have uh, no condom sex with a stranger. Good for you. I listened to Love Line. It's okay. it's great. It's great. It's great. I didn't have condom. Carlos, <laughs> learn. Have you had sex without a condom with a stranger? Yeah. Every time. Yeah. I mean, I mean, I've gotten, I've gotten, I've gotten, I've gotten STDs for with for my skin. <laughs> Yeah. Let's go to commercial break. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! It's just like this. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Like I've had stuff on my. What do you mean skin? My skin, my body. You so you've had my STDs. Trunk, my trunk. So you've had yeah. sex with a girl and then you had STDs on your skin? Yeah. Oh, it's, on your chest? Yeah. Like there's like skin, con skin stuff that you can get from towels and stuff. It's not that exciting. Yeah. What are you into sports at all? Um, as a fan, yeah. Like, are you a fan of sports? Do you watch sports? I, my thing is, I always like pro wrestling. That was the thing. nice. Yeah, yeah. So not real. Yeah. Okay. Well, no, it's like a play. You like, a, you, like the, you like the theater. Theater. Yeah. Yeah. I, like, who, who's your favorite pro wrestler? I mean, there he goes. That. I mean, I I can't. These are great questions. I wasn't prepared for, and they change over the years. You know, you don't meet your heroes. You meet them, and you're like, well, he's off the list. You know, like yeah. When mm -hmm. I was like, I don't know, like. Uh, Gerald Briscoe, I've become friends with Gerald Briscoe, who's an amazing, he's like WWE Hall of Famer. He's nice. Of yeah, great. Like, uh, Do you still go to the events? So, um, I go less now, but like I'm, I've been spoiled. You know, we get to invited to things. I've been to so many, like. Yeah, big mm. ones. Yeah. Like, uh, I went to WrestleMania this year in LA. Oh, really? Oh, you did? <laughs> I was supposed to start working for Fox Sports. They were gonna, I was gonna be like the, like a Daily Show tor correspondent for Fox. Do you go, you have a little He-Man in oh, your pocket? <laughs> <laughs> right. He's got like a Yoda Pez dispenser. I he's just ready. I don't. He's just ready to go. I don't understand. Do you like boxing? I'm not a fan of like these. Uh, I know it's not good for my comedy career. For yeah, but like I'm not a big MMA fan. No, we're not. Oh, a, we're, we're not big we MMA say, guys. We never said that either. You guys aren't like front row. Like, well, I know people. Fights and, no, we've been to the fights. Yeah, we've been to the fights. But it's not like we're not big. I'm not a fight. If you couldn't ask me, I didn't know. I don't know the ins and outs. I think you could take Edson Bar 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 Barbosa. Thank you. In a fight. I, I, you know, that's the third time I've heard that today. Okay. Yeah. I want to. Um, I'm going to show you, there's a new boxing league that I'm really into. I want to show you guys and I'm going to get your opinion okay, about it because on. I'm a huge fucking fan. This is like one of their premier fights that they just had. And you tell me who you think won. Okay. No. <laughs> okay. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh. Couple of points. That's pretty good. <laughs> what do you mean? What? It was Donnie. You both are in. Oh. So for people that love the show, yeah, they've yeah. been asking us for years, what's Doc up to? <laughs> Dude, how crazy is that? That's a great double punch. <laughs> double punch. Whoop. Yeah. Whoa. 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 Oh. Whoa. God, Whoa. This guy. Yeah. Right. There you go. <laughs> the black guy hasn't landed a punch. <laughs> it's so unfair it's because so the other unfair. guy's got like a full full upper body. Yeah. There you go. Oh, whoop. Oh, there it oh, is. Oh, there we go. Oh, a little tip tap. A little tip tap. Yeah. Get it. Is that a pacifier in his mouth? Yeah. Yeah. There you go. There you go. He's just a little baby fighting. No, dude, it's a mouth guard. It's a pacifier, you lunatic. All right, he's knocked that guy down no less than 12 times yeah. in this clip. God, it's, God, it's oh. incredible. Yeah. But it looks legit. Whoa, whoa. It's like a very... See, he gets up the same way I do because of my bad back. Like, I can't, he can't really bend. God, he's fucking... God, man. Killing that guy, but look. <laughs> he won. He won. <laughs> <laughs> he won. He, he won. Laugh. It's so funny. He won. Wow. Yeah. No, we're laughing at the brutalization. No, but now. the other guy laughed after he saw he lost. <laughs> yeah. 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 Somehow, some piece of me thinks it was a plant. <laughs> but man, the way he go to the very first second, the way he charges him, look at how hard he charges at this guy. He yeah. could have really fucking hurt him. Uh, yeah. Uh, I mean, man. Whoa. <laughs> That's insane. <laughs> That's a little much. Dude. It's a lot. <laughs> Anyway, I'm into this now. Yeah, but the, uh, it looks like the, the the guy in the blue though is um, a little person from just from the waist down almost. Yeah, he has like a I think the what torso is, in the. Well, when he was getting born, he halfway came out, and then his mom sneezed, and then. <laughs> <laughs> I see. I see. I see how that works. <laughs> gonna, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Sorry. Uh, yeah. That is funny. It's like, funny. And then it's funny 30 seconds later when you visualize it. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> what is this? So, what is this thing? What was you adamant to show us? 
Oh, uh, that this July, a uh, Portuguese man in uh, Turkey was in prison for three weeks for looking gay. Uh, well, go up to the top. A man was arrested for looking gay and wearing crop top in Turkey in prison for three weeks. Is he gay? No, I mm. believe that he just it's looks European. gay. European. Yeah. He's European. Oh, stolen valor. Yeah, yeah stolen valor. Dude, 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 that's a little too gay for me. That's the guy that got arrested for quote unquote not being gay? I mean, he's guilty. He's fucking Lock gay him shit. up. Yeah. Carlo, lock he's this guy guilty. Up. Yeah, yeah, lock him up. Somebody put a ring on if that. If he's gay, I'm gay. <laughs> Fuck it, let's do it. Somebody put a ring and handcuffs on this guy. Lock him up. He's so cute, though. You, when the cops arrested him, he was like, first of all, in Turkey, Turkey is not illegal to be gay. What's going on here? Is I don't this even... your Thanksgiving stories for us? Right. <laughs> so what? Is it because he was wearing inappropriate clothing? Yeah, it's not illegal, but the... Uh, Elder, uh, remains problematic. problematic despite certain legal advancements. Homosexuality is decriminalized. Uh, although homosexuality is decriminalized. Wow, thank... <laughs> like, it's like weed. It's decriminalized. <laughs> you can have homos on you, but you can't be using them when we catch you. <laughs> you can't do it in public. Yeah, you can't well, do that in some in African do that in private. <laughs> you can do that stuff. You can do gay stuff in private like weed, but you can't... Well, there's some African countries that's death penalty. Oh. What do you mean? Still, if you're gay, Af there's some Middle Eastern countries where it's fucking death penalty. Right. You go, you go get caught in the Middle East, and half the places they'll fucking kill you. There's That's insane fucking, to me. Some places that's insane kill. to you. Um, yeah. What the fuck? I don't think it's even an argument. If you, you, you wait, wait. Those are the countries where it's illegal to be gay. Why'd they yeah. make them pink? That's, That's such a gay. Look country. at there's one little. <laughs> there's one little pink area in South America. Where's that? What country is that? Yeah. Oh, what? Yeah, Guyana. Life yeah. in prison. Guyana. Life in, Guyana. And gay is in it. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Guyana. Let's see how gay all these countries sound. Go over the name yeah, yeah, of them. Yeah. Let's see if it sounds gay. Chad. 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 I used to fuck a guy named Chad. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I am Chad. What else? <laughs> well, you get fined 500,000 West African CFA francs. Oh, that's, that's like $3. 30 yeah. bucks. <laughs> <laughs> Indonesia. I do know that. Yeah, yeah, yeah it yeah. is criminal to be gay there. Uzbekistan. Ooh. Stan. Mm. Uh, that's pretty like Marta Mari. Death by stoning? Where? Stoning. Right there. In Muritiana. Muritania? Oh, that's sad. You know why they do that? They're trying to get attention. I've never heard of this fucking country in my life. Where the fuck is that? Muritania in Africa. On the horn of Africa. Stoning. Jesus Christ. Gone. Imagine gone. the guy that's got to go get the stones. That's even <laughs> more insane. To call, you got to go get stones to hurt. If you're people. getting stoned, can you cover your face with your hands or no? No, they Probably. tie you up. I think. Uh, oh, they do. Okay, it's a crazy shit. You can't do this. No, you can, but it's like. No, you can't. Yeah, it's. No, no, they tie their hands behind 40, their back. Forty people. No, no, they they. Oh, well, you've been to a couple. I've seen them. Spain. I'm sure being. <laughs> I, by the way, you guys have invented gay. <laughs> right. Let's not do a picture of it, bud. No, I'm just. What's that? That's a stoning. Carlos oh is like, God, I actually dude. went to a stoning one. Yeah. So <laughs> there was blood, blood everywhere. What's that? What's that right that there? That is a stoning. That's insane. I what would, is that? I would go to one just to see. All right. A stoning? Yeah. You're <laughs> fucking disgusting. He had a stoning this morning. <laughs> a cockfight versus a stoning of a human being? Well, the animals still like fight to the death. Yeah, but like, at least they have a fair shot. Yeah, the person that's getting stoned doesn't isn't well, throwing rocks himself. By the way, that's hey. if you do get stoned and they just give you a few back to throw back, they're like, "All right, let's go." Oh yeah, that'd be fair. F fight back. Yeah, yeah. Well, it still wouldn't be fair. That guy threw a first stone when he sucked that dick, though. <laughs> oh my God, <laughs> Jesus Christ! I just got back from Texas. <laughs> yeah. People in well-decorated interior houses should not be throwing stones. It is unbelievable how some parts of the world is just not the same. I mean, it's like they're not, they just haven't caught up or they have these old traditions and rules. It's weird. Yeah. Because we're so connected, you know what I mean, through the internet that like, I just can't see how it's possible. What do you mean? That did people have these weird rules like, you know. Well, these are based on thousands of years of them being indoctrinated with an idea of their most... 99% of that is religious based that homosexuality is against their 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 religious practice Yeah, but as a kid, I, I'm, I'm not kidding you. My dad would be like if you're if you're Steve gay Everybody gonna die. I'm gonna kill everybody. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> he would say stuff like that. Yeah, thank God like that, everybody that, Yeah, your friend Charlie Franco they all die. That's insane. Uh, insane, right? You think he was just joking. Around? No, he was like saying it was in other words if you met a Vietnamese Woman, hmm. don't call. Her. Well, that I understand. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's like I won't call then. Fuck you. You know what I mean? But even as a kid, you listen to that. You're six years old at dinner. You know what I mean? Yeah. If you get everybody, that, and, and I'd be eating my you know Korean food, I'd be like, that's insane. That doesn't make any sense. What did your mom say? 
She said, okay, okay. <laughs> hinake, hinake. You know what I mean? Like try to play it off, but it's like, you hear all these things. And even as a kid living in that house, yeah. I was able to go, you know what? That just sounds like insane. And it doesn't make any sense. Yeah, it doesn't. It just doesn't seem right. It doesn't seem right. So it's like, and you kind of, so I'm just saying like these countries, you don't, you, there's not a kid there going, yeah, this seems weird. Probably, uh, you would think there would be a bunch of kids. I think, but I think if everybody around you is is speaking the same language, it'd be hard to learn another I, one. Really? Like, I, I just don't. I just think if everyone, dude, if you're if you're only shown one thing, and, and particularly if you're shown that Western culture is bullshit, if they're talked about that we're bullshit, that we're disgusting and against what they believe in their religious beliefs, then of course they fucking hate us. Or you see like a group being oppressed mm. and you're doing the oppressive. Like I would in my mind be like, no, this is not, this seems. You would think so, but that's only because you've gotten what you've gotten. No, I think that, I mean, maybe I'm wrong and I, I don't know, but maybe I'm wrong. But I feel like no matter what society that I'm in, I would look at the circumstances and go, you know, that doesn't make any sense. That's if you're lucky enough to be educated. No, I think it's just a thing. No, but I'm saying if you're young and you're uneducated, Bob, you don't have these kind of. I was uneducated. I've never read a book in my life. You grew up in America, in a. Oh, okay, okay. In a, okay. In, you know what I mean, like. But do you know? Do you guys understand what I'm saying? Uneducated, and if your needs are not met, then you're thinking of other things like there's survival. There's always and a group of people that think like that in every country. Yeah, there's people that you think see how those women like march in Iran, despite right. the fact that they were. Like, this is also this is also helped because of the internet and knowledge, right? So for for a long time, no one had knowledge of any other way. Like they would live kind of sheltered off. So they would shelter people from learning about Western ideology and culture, about our, our freedom of, you know, of sex and religion and blah, blah, blah. And I think a lot of that was like, that's an evil shit mm. when they do read about it. But now with the internet, right, they're privy to seeing way more. That's why fucking North Korea, he can't, doesn't have the fucking internet. He doesn't want them to, to right. learn what the fuck's going on in the world. Because yeah. they'll all go, what? Yeah. We're, we should leave. We would get the fuck out. Yeah, it's like for me, like my dad beating me and my brother, right? It's like in my mind, I'm like, oh, I'm never going to do this to another human being. But there are some kids that perpetuate that cycle oh, and they course. do it to their own children. Yeah. So I that, guess I was just have this weird think, way of thinking. Well, maybe you're lucky that it turned out that way because you could be an abusive lunatic too. I think it's now. Luck. Yeah, I think it's luck. It was traumatized into you. No, I just think that some, I don't know. No, I think you're lucky. It's like dude. that you no, could have turned out the other way. I think it's also like, this ability, I don't know, forget it. It's what? not a comedy, but I, you know, I, I just want to argue this fact that I see this in, you know, when people get sober, right? It's like um, last week, some guy just got sober that we know, right? And he was able to go inside himself and go, you know, um, I think I have a problem. You know, I'm no longer in denial. And I, I, I think that if I keep doing this, I can see down the road that I'm going to lose everything. So I'll stop here. I've always been like that, where I'm like, you know, I haven't lost anything. Like every time I get sober, I haven't lost anything, but I can feel in a year or two, if this behavior continues, that I will, so I stop it here. Right. And some people don't have that ability. They just go all the way at, to the end. Yeah. No, they can't help it. And I don't know why that is. Yeah, that's- But some people just have that. That's right. Some people just can't help the way they react to how they're, inner demons or shortcomings or addictions or things control them. That's my point mm. is some people have traumatic things when they were a kid and they, it's almost like this deep rooted thing they can't get rid of. And you're very blessed that you're able to shift. And I don't think it. it's a gift. I just, I just don't understand it myself. I, I, well, that's why it must be a gift. It's not you. If it's not you, it's something else. It's the Lord. It's the Lord Jesus Christ. The Lord Jesus Christ. I knew it was. Was the Lord Jesus. Our Lord and yeah. Savior. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Our Lord and Savior. And I'm sorry for that guy who got arrested for being gay in Turkey. You come over here to West Hollywood. Yeah. And we'll open our arms and our buttholes to you. And you're, even if you're not gay. I know he said he's not gay. Well, I had a fun little weekend in Vegas. And I'm, sa I'm sad that I came back early because I didn't go to go to F1. But boy, oh boy, did I have fun out there. F1. Tell me about it. I mean, it's just, I didn't get to see F1. But it, I got to hang out with some of the other people that were in it. It was wild to like. Give me a name. Uh, you don't know F1, do you? No, but there are celebrities there you're hanging out with? No. I mean, F1 guys are celebrities in the F1 world. But if you don't oh, know- the drivers? Who, yeah, do you know who Lando Norris is? Or the Bush guy. Carlos Sands. Bush? Yeah. But that's NASCAR. Uh-huh. Kyle Bush? Yeah. Wrong wrong, ga wrong game. Is it buddy. a machine, though? You're driving around in a machine? F1, it's- Different level. I it's get it now. this, dude. All right, all right, I learned. <laughs> all right. <laughs> love it, love it. I love it. <laughs> Did you know that? I don't know anything. Yeah, yeah, yeah I don't know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 
No, those guys, I mean, it's just impressive to watch them operate. But the NASCAR drivers, you guys are also very talented. I mean, is cockfighting like that? Is there like different levels? Oh, yeah. Top cock. <laughs> top cock. Oh, top cock is different than just regular street Top level cock, cock on cock. Netflix. It's one of the best shows out. Oh, right. really? Top cock. Who has the best, what's the best, <laughs> who has the best co cockfighting skills? You have no <laughs> idea who top cock is right now? Orlando Falandro won top cock this season. Is that a real guy? I, 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 are you Orlando joking? Florando. Orlando Fernando won top Orlando cock. Fernando? <laughs> Orlando Fernando? Orlando Florlando. <laughs> he won top cock this year. Really? And where is he from? Spain? He's a Cuban guy that lives in fucking oh, Miami. And his his chicken, what, his cock. Yeah, he and he comes out with his cock and he goes, cluck, 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 to intimidate the other top really? cock. Really? Yeah. Wow. He says, Florlando is here. Cluck, 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 yeah. cluck, cluck. And everyone hates it. And what are those, are those cocks? What are their names? Like his cock, what's his cock's name? Well, he, 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 his cock must retire. I mean, how many fights can they do? Buddy, you don't know anything about cockfighting. They retire when they die. They kill, they fight to the death. Oh, so he's been a lot. So his main cock, what's his name? Orlando's cock. The name of, it's called Orlando's cock. Yeah, That's the joke. Oh, really? Because yeah. so if I saw Orlando's cock, I'd go, hey, Orlando's cock. You'd go, hey, nice Not cock. Not Jimmy. No, Orlando's Hi, cock. Hi, Jimmy. And he walks out, he goes, okay. who wants to see Orlando's cock? <laughs> <laughs> that's what he does really? when he comes out. Yeah. Wow. I had no idea. And that's kind of his top bit. cock on Netflix. Top cock on Netflix. Download it right now. It's, is it all about him or are there other cockfighters? Well, he's featured because he won this season. But give me, name me another guy. That's maybe his nemesis. Oh, who? Orlando's nemesis? Yeah. Uh, Miami Jimeen. <laughs> They're all from. They're all Cubans that live oh, in Florida. Oh, I don't know. So my, Miami Jimeen. Miami Jabin. Jabin. Yeah, Miami Jabin. Lives Jabin. in Miami too. Well, you say it like Miami Jabin. Miami Jabin. Yeah, he's one of the other ones. Right. And then he, does he have a cock? Oh, he's got a real nice cock. <laughs> right, what's it called? Marcus. <laughs> I, that's what he calls it. Marcus. Marcus. I think. It, it has Marcus and um, Orlando's, Orlando's cock? cock fight before? They fought in season one or two. But I thought two. they fight to the death. Yeah, they fought in season one or two. You know who I'm rooting so for. So he no longer, one of them no longer exists. Marcus. Marcus died. Marcus is gone. Oh, Marcus There's gone an there. undercard, though. Susan Smith. Oh, Susan Smith yeah. is pretty good. She lives in Florida, but her cock is crazy. It's crazy. Big. Susan Smith's cock is yeah, really Susan's nice. Is, is it nice? Yeah. 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 The this cock can knit. It knits <laughs> right yeah. before a fight. She's Maybe from, one of the nicest cocks I've ever she's seen. She's from Connecticut, but she moved for the competition. Whoa. Yeah. And they have the little, the knives. Razors. Razors. Razors, dude. Yeah. Uh, they can't they don't have hands to Honestly, hold them. Honestly, if you're gonna talk about stuff like that, <laughs> at least see the fucking show. <laughs> I know, but do they have the little razors? Yeah, right? Susan's cock is shredded. Is there a shredded. company that is, that makes that, or, or is it like dueling companies? Like the, you know, because in F one we have the dueling car companies and this and that and brands. Uh huh. So does like the razors have their own? Oh, companies that make the razors. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I mean, cock cutters out of uh, uh, cock cutters is one, that's out of Dallas, Texas, probably oh, they, some of the they're best. They're the best. Yeah, cock cutters. Anything from the, the different lands or like a different country. Well, uh, well. You think the Philippines probably? I don't know if out. I should mention this now, given yeah. what's going on in the world right yeah. now. Yeah, but Israel, Israel probably made some of the best cock cutting <laughs> tools of all time. Wow. I mean, Israel probably made some of the best cock cutting tools, <laughs> but they're not using them right now because of right. what's going on over there. I yeah. see. So, but you can still probably get stuff from black market. Like if I had if I had a cock I was raising and I, I want the best Israeli. Cock cutter. Cock cutter. Yeah. I could probably get in the black market. Honestly, the black market has the best cocks. Yeah. Some would argue that the black market has the best cocks, but. The black market has the best cut cutter, cock cutters. And cocks. And but cocks. No yeah. one's afraid, but people are so afraid to use them. Well, they're probably supposed to be heavy. Yeah. I tell you, when they hit you, they hurt. <laughs> <laughs> I bet. Yeah. That's, it's just lugging that around. It's just, it's just bigger than normal. Yeah. It's bigger than usual. I want lightweight, like NASA shit. Right. Well, like if I had a cock, I would have lightweight, like a small little Asian. You one. want a tiny little Asian cock? Yeah, from maybe from China. <laughs> well, little China lightweight one. Well, you do. You get. <laughs> you can get. You know into I mean? a There's different leagues. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You get to the yellow league. There's a yellow card league. There is. Yeah. <laughs> I tell you what, though, so once funny. you get one of those the black yellow. cocks, you never turn it back. <laughs> once you get a black cock, you never turn it back. Oh, so once if you I have let a, that uh, in the arena, right? right. Yeah. You'll never go back. Never. And you'll ever. never get a little Asian one. Well, why would you? It's just once you've graduated. You know? Okay. You don't go from a four door car down to a fucking smart car. You know, like you already have a. Right. I can't know. I didn't know you that. Stay that was, up there. So co 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 what's it called? Top Cock on Top Netflix. Top Cock on Netflix. Okay. I think season three or four. Carlos, what is it? We watch it together. We're on four now. Four seasons. Yeah. Season four. We're binging it together. Wow. Yeah. What's the origin of cockfighting? I don't know anything about it. Where did it start? Yeah. Uh, I, I, this is kind of it's kind of like a history piece. If you're a history buff out there, people that were coming to Flo South Florida uh -huh. from Cuba. 
uh, or the DR, mostly from Cuba. Oh, Dominican Republic. Republic, yeah. Um, it's, when they're floating over here, when they're rafting here, what ends up happening is you have to bring, you know, food and provisions and also pets and friends. And they all bring a cock with them, at least one cock. Right. And when oh, you I, bump into another raft, right. you have to go head to head. Otherwise, you get sacrificed your rations on the way in. Yeah. They can basically def- I heard that one story in 30 years ago where a cock he still had his little and inflated, deflated, deflated the, one of the other rafts. And they all drowned. That's, I remember that. That's partially where it yeah, started. Yeah. I was like, take them off and put it in the thing. <laughs> right. But he went, tsk, tsk, and then they sank. And they was like, your cock popped my raft. And that was like right, the beginning right, of everything. Right. I remember that story. Yeah. I know a little bit about it. Your cock sunk my battleship. It was basically what happened. <laughs> right, right. I know a little bit. Yeah, yeah. That's interesting. It was. It's. A, you got to watch Top Cock on Netflix right now. Yeah, it's great. Right. I was going to say, Andrew, I've been to a real cock fight before. In Bali, there's blood everywhere. I had to get out. From the cocks? There's cock blood all over the yeah, place? Yeah, it was crazy. Uh, Did like, they have a guy that comes up and ke- cleans the like, cock blood? Because that sounds like a job for McCone. No, as soon as there's blood, I was like, I got to roll. Yeah, you know, it's so back. funny because we took a comedy bit. <laughs> and made it sad. <laughs> and riffed, riffed on it. And then you brought reality into the game, which yeah. sort of fucked up the momentum, no? I know. It was I, really bad. I mean, it's like, you what were, are you doing? It was fun. I wanted to, I went to one. It was bloody. I yeah, I mean, a lot of fucking birds died. It was gnarly. Yeah, yeah, we it get it. It was like though. intense. Yeah, yeah. Get the fuck out of there. It is disgust. It is dis- yeah. well, but disgusting. I'll thing. tell you what's more disgusting. What? Dog fighting. Oh, I can't. Don't even. Oh, yeah. No. Don't even. Don't even. Okay, you want to hear something then? No, I don't want to know. I don't. I hate it. No, we're about. Any video- no, no. Listen. Yeah, we're about to get another dog. Oh, and one, great. And dude. one of the dogs we're rescuing was part of uh, one of these train kill shelters. Oh, I thought you were training. Them. A pit bull? It has pit in it. Yeah, yeah. It's mixed. But is he nice? Well, I haven't met him yet. We're about to go. We want to go get him. Okay. But make they- sure though. Make sure. No, dude, you can, you can, you can reverse. They they train them from their. You can puppies. reverse it, yeah. But also, this is their puppies. They're puppies. Oh, they're puppies. Oh, good, yeah. good, good. Yeah, yeah. I'd we're, love to meet it. We're trying to say we're trying to save them because they. Uh, it's crazy to think people fucking see a puppy, and they're like, "I'm gonna make it a killing machine." Yeah, it's a insane. puppy. Yeah. What the fuck is wrong with people on earth? I think if you fuck with dogs and fuck up and hurt dogs, I think that should be a higher penalty than when you murder a human. Yeah. Well, I, am I, I wrong? They're am I, babies. They have, they're defenseless is the thing. Yeah. A human can fight back. If you killed a human, but you had a reason for someone killing someone, right? Like a gang that hates another gang. There's reasoning. And a human has defense. And a, a puppy, has, a dog has no defense. Mm. What about cocks? Cocks are very defensive. Okay. And they, their mood swings are insane. Sometimes they're kind of buckled in. Mm. Sometimes they're really showing off. <laughs> true, true. You know what else videos I don't like when people are when their dog or cat is passing. Mm. We had the music. They have Such some sort of. Bang, I've never doo-doo. seen those videos. Right, yeah, your your algorithm is different than mine. Yeah, doo-doo. right, yeah. and it's and it's like you know too white. Right. Why is it why, why, white? Because we care. It, no, because they want to show off their grief. Ugh, Let's be real. That's yeah, gross. but when, yeah, because when Asians, they're like okay and go. <laughs> you are not crying yeah, beforehand. Record, do, 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 do. <laughs> right, and they do it right, and they cut it off. They're like, okay, well, let's go. You know what I mean? Bye. Bye. bye, bye. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> you can keep but it. But I don't like it. I, it makes me so sad. Like I'm so sensitive to it. I don't like it. Yeah, I don't like it either. Anything yeah. with animals, I don't like. Mm-mm. Here's another thing I fucking hate. <laughs> it makes me so fucking angry, dude. I saw a video once where this guy had his dog. They're running by a, a swamp. And an alligator just comes out of nowhere and eats the I dog. I saw that. Yeah, and it's like, bro, leash it! <laughs> leash the fucking puppy! You know there's alligators in that shit! <laughs> what are you doing, dude? Leash it! Yeah. There's a piece of me that... God! Maybe that, they should... maybe that guy did that on purpose. <clears throat> Everybody that lives in Florida knows there's alligators all in those fucking... Oh, you think he yeah. purposely did this? I think he was fucking... Ir- a poodle. It was a poodle, oh. I think. Well, maybe he was getting on his fucking nerves. Do you think when the alligator burped, like, for just... <laughs> <laughs> what if, like, the do- dogs were running around and uh, it was a Chinese guy that came out? <laughs> <laughs> That'd be a switch. <laughs> crocodile! <Yeah>. Cro- <laughs> crocodile! <laughs> oh, well. He's just wearing a crocodile mask. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> When's the first time you fucked? I say 20. Will you say but, 20, but it wasn't? Whatever. Uh, fucked, fucked fuck is 21. Then why 20? I, I got on crack. Well, why I, 20? I did a little bit of something when I was 20, you know? Like you dipped it in? Yeah, yeah, one of those deals. Yeah. Well, a little bit, huh? What go, is it called? No. Let it soak. You let it you, soak. You soaked it I in. I didn't even, I just did like, it was just like, and she was like, all the, 
every woman I've ever, by the way, like every woman I've ever dated, like has been like, or hooked up with whatever has been like, uh, uh, condom, I don't need it. Like all the stereotype of a man is like, guys are like, oh, I don't want, oh, I forgot it. We don't need it. Right. Every woman I've ever, you know, you know, I'm, no, well, you know no, what, I don't know what, you, I don't know. I don't know what you're saying. Well, Go here's ahead. why he look, <laughs> I don't know what you're saying. If I'm a girl, you look clean. Thank you. Yeah. That's what I'm saying. I, if I was I, a woman, I, I, I'd be like, no, this guy's fine. Yeah. Thank you. But, yeah. Uh, also, I wouldn't be afraid of you getting me pregnant. Yeah. I figured, you know, like you decent genetics. Like... No, 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 no. I feel like they would be um, just really they, they're swimmers. Relax, relax. But they're not going the right direction. Right. OK. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. They're going back in. Do you think I'm infertile or just. No, no, no. You have a lot of sperm, but they go back into your penis. OK. And all you get is the liquid part. OK. Yeah. But they're back in. I think they get nervous. They get out there and they're like, oh, no. Yeah. And they go right back. Yeah. Thank you. They get a little. I think they get a little tepid. I, I, I also think that your testicles are cozy. Oh yeah, you, you look like a cozy warm testicle. balls. Yeah, yeah, warm, warm balls. Yeah, let's, I love this. Yeah, whatever the opposite of bullying is. Jebediah, let's go back. I don't know what their names what's are, the but bigger, like, what's the bigger? <laughs> yeah, what's the bigger testicle, right or left? I don't know. Are they different sizes? They sure are. One hangs lower for sure. I yeah. just learned they moved like recently. They go wherever they want. Recently, yeah. you know, we were never in cold weather. But I mean, like you can hold them, and then they 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 like they're kind of like uh, what are those Mexican jumping beans. Kind of. <laughs> jumping. Sorry, Carlos. So, no, but that's what they're called. <laughs> <laughs> I know. Thank you. Sorry. Respect. Thanks. It's by the way. Somehow Mexican jumping beans is sounds so racist. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Is it not what they're called? It just I'll... sounds like something Trump said. Yeah, it does. I was at the airport. They're Mexican jumping beans, <laughs> right over the wall. <laughs> over the wall they go. Yeah. Bing bang bing. <laughs> <laughs> it sounds like he yeah, said that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mexican jumping, jumping beans. beans. All right. But is that not what they're called? No, they are. Yeah, they are. They are. I was at the airport in Tucson, and they had them for sale. I haven't seen those in like twenty years. So it's like well, the they, Yeah, they probably got rid of them for. Well, a while. What, there are little insects in the bean, right? Yeah, yeah and they're trying to get out. Yeah, yeah they're, being, they're, di- they're, they're, they're slowly dying. They're yeah. tortured animals. It's like sea monkeys. They're just like creatures you're torturing. Well, what what creatures are we okay with torturing then? I guess let's make a standard. I don't like this, but lobsters. People are down for just like, it's like. Dude, do you know about lobsters though? Yeah. They're evil. The, oh yeah, they're yeah. they're satanic. I didn't. Oh good. Oh yeah, yeah. They their claws, uh, fucking this is what they're doing the whole time. Well, yeah, yeah, they're doing this, and then they're like molesting crabs. Six 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 six. That's how they. They fondle the crab. The crabs are like, dude, they're victims, dude. Yeah. But if someone hurt. It's not it doesn't make it okay. But someone hurt. Hurt people hurt. Someone did that to them, and now they do it to, to us. The, to the lobster? Who yeah. did it to the lobster? I don't know. But I don't know. Squids. Oh yeah, those Maybe fucking squids, dickheads. Those fucking assholes. <sighs> You know who we like the least on this show? Dolphins. Dolphins can fuck right off. Perverts. Yeah. Pigs. They're pigs. You know, honestly, do you like dolphins? No. Be real. Do I? I mean, I, do, I would, like if you're in the ocean, you saw a dolphin next to you. What would you do? In the ocean, I would be scared. Honestly, if I saw a dolphin next. To you. <laughs> if not, I if I'm in the ocean and I'm not gonna uh, do anything to you. Yeah, yeah. What are you scared? I don't want. I'd be like, is that a dolphin or a shark? First well, of all. well, he just told you it's a dolphin. Well, yeah, the yeah, dolphin's yeah. like, don't worry, I'm a dolphin, bro. I'll be like, he, they don't say that. They don't say that. So then they I, go, and then they start yeah, fucking. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Are they just chilling next to you, like, so you can get a good look? They'll swim by you. I don't know they're chilling. They're not like. <laughs> I don't want. To, I don't be next to a yeah. dolphin in the water. But if I'm in, like, if I was recently at a friend's house who's doing well for himself, and he has a house by the beach, and I, we saw dolphins in. Daniel room. Tosh, we get it. Oh yeah, Danny. Yeah, you know Danny. Yeah, from Florida. Yeah. yeah, Danny from Florida. That's what we call him. You call Daniel Tosh Daniel from Danny from yeah. Florida. So you went to Danny's house. Was that Danny from Florida? From Tor- Florida's house. <laughs> when he calls into radio shows, that's the, that's what he calls. Okay. Him. So you Danny, went to his house. Danny no, from Florida. I was at Mac Finn Max's house. And, but uh, Max has money and he lives on the beach in Malibu. Yeah. Wow. Wow. That's cool, man. That's great. But the but the problem though is that uh, in like ten years the house is gonna be gone and you Who can't cares? It. We'll Who be cares? dead in ten it years. Ten years. Oh, good. I didn't know that. Did you not hear Joe Biden address the country yesterday? Okay, what did he say? We'll be dead in ten years. That's a, he was like, well, we're gonna be gonna be dead. ten years of eleven March are gonna fall 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 apart. So. You say I'm gonna be dead in ten years, or I gonna... couldn't make it out what he was saying, but I did think he was saying the world's over. Uh, did you translate any of that stuff? No, but he did mention something about Taylor too. Did about really... ta- about this Taylor? Yeah, Biden. What did he say? No, he said that we're all gonna die, but specifically Taylor Williams. <laughs> yeah, that's all fucked up. Do you see the picture of his cake on fire? Did you see that photo? Oh, yeah. Well, no. Did you see oh, let me see it. Let me see it. This is classic Joe Biden. This is this is our president. That's just crazy. That's crazy, dude. 81 candles. It's on fire. <laughs> it's crazy. It's not. Happy birthday, Joe. You're on fucking fire. Should I blow these out? <laughs> I no, know. dude. You'll die. That's a, that's really, that's like a joke. Why is, how is that real? Here's the problem with this guy. Yeah. He, so many. I could go on for hours. He's really genuinely 
so unaware. It's not even his fault anymore. They're parading this guy around like fucking... Uh, <laughs> oh, I mean, genuinely, they're parading this guy around that, and he has no clue what's going on. Yeah. yeah. Like, they literally posed him for that, but they put his arms like that. He's like Gumby. You think he was posed like that? A hundred percent. I bet my life on it. No. That's so he doesn't fall. You know, or... the, this guy, the earth is spinning fast for this guy. But when you put your arms out like that, the candles were probably normal, and he could have done that with his dark Brandon. Oh, wow. Laser eyes. Yeah, dude. That's cool if that's true, honestly. Now, have you ever met a lizard person, a p politician of any sort of strength or power? Have you ever been in, in, uh, in a room with any lizard people? Not, not lizard people. I've done some USO tours, so I've met like the chairman, the joint chief of staff. Whoa. <laughs> That's pretty good. I know. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Close. I spent 4th of July with General Millie. Whoa. Millie Bobby Brown. Yeah. From, when did she get generalized? From Stranger Things. No, no. I didn't know she got generalized. Congrats, Millie Bobby Brown. Was, is he nice, General Millie? He's so badass and cool. I think he's a Massachusetts guy. Is that him right there? He's a. Yeah. It, and That's a badass dude. And he's a Trump. Like, he's famous because Trump. We, we're not supposed to know who these people are, you know? But he's yeah. famous because Trump is always hating on him because he, he, like, kept the democracy intact. Yeah, stuff, yeah. Like, yeah. That's okay. cool, though. Look at all those fucking things on his chest. Look at the little flags. Those are all the countries that he, he bombed. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> is there one for swimming or something? Yeah. Like, are there other. Like, is it canoeing and stuff? The like, very, the Boy the Scouts or no? The very top one is for swimming. If <laughs> if you can hold your breath in an Olympic pool down and back once, yeah. give you the first. You get the one. top one. That's the first. Can you one. zoom in a little bit? I'll tell you what all those are. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Tell me, tell me what all those are. All right. So the top one's swimming, right? The very, very right top. underneath it to the left, the green, green and yellow. A dozen chicken wings in under a minute. <laughs> <laughs> really? That's what it is. I had no idea. Yeah, my my uncle's in the military. He tells me all this fucking yeah. stuff. It's wild. Oh, I know the one to the right. Where he the... broke three boards with the karate chop. Yeah, karate chop. That's karate chop board. It, yeah, yeah. yeah. So that's I've, I have one of those. It's, the not, one it's somehow that. not that impressive. I somebody. know. I mean, I have one. My dad has one. Well, my whole family has one. Do you have a karate shop uh, medal? No, I got to yellow belt and I, uh, my mom started taking karate, single mom, cool, but single mom style. She took it, the same, I was taking karate the same time she was taking karate. And then, she, so she took it because I was taking it. And then I, I failed the orange belt test and she passed the orange belt test. I was like, karate. No, really? I Wait, you're, did she keep there. going? Is yeah. your mom a black belt now? No, she stopped after I stopped. After she fucked you up, she quit. That's so funny that your mom stopped after she beat you. So you have yellow still for the rest of your life and your mom has orange. Yeah. Man, that's so cool. Um, your mom's the shit. Is she available? able to come on the show at some point um i mean what does she do for a living she's a brilliant artist like she, she was she famous is? in japan and <laughs> that's why i started taking japanese lessons I just, what's her name can we look can we showcase her art if you really i would love to unfortunately her online presence isn't killer someone else has her name if you look up suzanne marie art del mar you'll find her suzanne marie art del mar so down in del mar does she have a shop so yeah that's one of her uh like that one the second one like that's some of her art okay okay let's see some her art's been in a bunch of movies and stuff oh Oh, okay. And stuff. Like, Whoa, that's beautiful. That's beautiful. Let me see. Zoom in on that. She was like legit superstar in the '90s. Can I tell you? I was in uh, Japan a few years ago. Yeah. And I walked by an art gallery, and I went inside. And in Japanese, these people don't speak English. I was like, "Boku no Okasan Suzanne Marie des." Like my mom is Suzanne Marie, and they were all freaking out because she was like, "I think they were freaking out because you spoke Japanese." <laughs> <laughs> oh, 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 you know, oh, oh. Pearman, <laughs> Pearman speak Japanese too. <laughs> And this creepy old Japanese guy who's like probably 70, he was like, oh, Suzanne Marie, very tall. And I was like, okay. Wait, 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 wait. Oh. That's fucking great, actually. She's, she's so special. Is that oil? Um, I don't uh, I don't know what it was made on. Uh, I don't know. Do you watch her work ever? I uh, know. You don't fucking know what your mom's, what medium of she art she uses oil. She uses, uh, she uses acrylic. Where does she live? San Diego? Yeah, yeah. Del Mar, we know. And do you go down there and visit her? Yeah. And you don't see her studio? Um, she's not doing as much as she used to. She's an older. She's not old. old. She's not old. She's been doing on some other. But stuff. she's still with the, your stepdad. Yeah, yeah. You like him? Yeah. What does he do? Uh, he's a doctor. Oh, she did good. Yeah, he said Del Mar. Oh, Del Mar, nice. I'm living in Del Mar, if he's yeah. You, know, you ever go to the Del Mar Fair? Teaching fourth I've grade. Been to Del Mar Fair. I love the Del Mar Fair. Yeah, it's a nice yeah. part of San Diego. It's very nice. I like it up there. Del Mar is beautiful. Yeah, I'm lucky. I grew, it's funny. Like I grew up a single mom style, in, like a little townhouse, you know, and like like. Uh, and like artist styles, so like some years like we have money, some years like we're broke. What are we doing? You know, and uh, but all my friends are like filthy rich. Yeah, that's gotta be wild to grow up in that world where you are the poor artist scumbag <laughs> child. So and everybody you, else is finance kids. I remember, like, my buddy got, like, a BMW M3 for his 16th birthday. And, for his fucking birthday? Oh, yeah. And wow. then, and then he gets, Jesus. And then he has a job at the... They all, this is what they do, because the one of them marries... 
I, it's the dad marries a normal kind woman, you know, who's like not <laughs> rich, you know, that's the generation, you know, yeah. now women have jobs. It's beautiful. Yeah. And, you know, I'm saying, am I canceled? So then, um, <laughs> but then, uh, but then like they, they get jobs at like the movie theater. Cause like my mom told me I have to get a service job. But they have to just work a regular job. Jobs is M3 to make like uh, $5 an hour at the movie. Keep theater. them humble in some way. <laughs> yeah. Right. It's a balance. Yeah. I get that. Mm. That makes sense though. Mm -hmm. Cause you had money coming. You worked at the fucking coffee shop or whatever. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, I worked at Postal Annex. Did you really? Yeah. For two, uh, t uh, three years, Postal Annex. God, that's so funny. Yeah. Can we go back to your mom's art or no? I, used to, I could hold an envelope and tell you how much it weighed and how many stamps it needed. Yeah. That's could, so pathetic. That's my mom's art. Can I yeah. buy it? How much is a piece? You're so sweet. I would love to connect you. She's she is she's been. But how much is it? I don't know. I don't know. Get guess. It says six hundred dollars. I mean, oh, that's six hundred dollars. This is a serograph. It's not an original. Oh. But, um, I'll do the six hundred. Okay. I yeah, mean, this yeah. is, I don't. This doesn't go to her, but this is some like creepy guy who has her stuff from a long time ago. Yeah. yeah. Then I won't add it to cart. Yeah, yeah. don't buy it from this. Yeah. I don't. I, I don't like these people. Whoever they are, they're just scumbags who like own her stuff from a long time ago. And, Re oh, really? And they're reselling her art. Yeah. Well, this show is gonna help. So I guess don't buy any any of the fans that are interested. Please don't buy anything unless it's going to be direct <laughs> and if you want to buy direct for taylor's mom's art his phone number is right here on the screen we're going to put it up right on the screen taylor's direct cell phone number call him and ask him for uh the link to his mom's art thank I you i appreciate honestly like uh my please i there's, there's another suzanne marie respect to her but it's not my mom the one that's mostly on the internet not my mom she just didn't adapt with social media and all right. that. Right. She's just mm. more private collector. She's a big thing at Hebrew University. If you ever go out there, she does a lot of things for private collectors. If you can't get a hold of Taylor from the phone number we just put on the screen, <laughs> we're going to also put up his home address right now. <laughs> I'd like you to go by his house, say hi to him, give him a handshake, uh, and tell him that you'd like to buy some of his mom's art. Yeah. Keep going. Thank you. Yeah. She teaches it. So she teaches art at Hebrew University. Oh, or? She, her work has been in. Oh, let's go. Let's go back to your past. I think her art. Can we go back to your past? Her arts in the movie Bachelor Party where it falls off the wall. Oh, oh really? Yeah. Tom Hanks. Yeah. Woo. Great movie. I love that movie. She has the art piece that falls off the back of the wall. Yeah. Hmm. Barry Diamond's in that movie. Barry Diamond. I've opened for him. Rest in peace. Let's move on. He's not dead. <laughs> Is he not? No. Oh, wow. Some people so, you just think are dead. Yesterday I thought, is John Goodman dead? No, he's still alive. I know. I know. And but but uh, but do you? We know knew who just I, died. Who? Jimmy Carter's wife. Yeah. Rosalind Carter. She did. She was ninety four. Oh no. He's ninety nine, still alive. What's he up to, J J C? <laughs> <laughs> like just every second, I want to stay alive. He's just staying alive. Staying alive, dude. That rest in peace. I saw a video today of a guy who's one hundred and three years old. They said, "What's the secret?" I mean, it's just go, no? No, no, you got to ride it out. Oh, you got to ride it out? Till the wheels fall off. Yeah. Now, with that picture of him with the thing over his eye, I remember this happened. Who fucked him up? <laughs> Was he at a bar and just got fucking not... Imagine Jimmy Carter. Oh, I know what it is. Look, he looks Japanese there. Oh. Stop Asian hate. Stop That's Asian what happened, hate. dude. Did someone attack Jimmy Carter thinking he was Asian? <laughs> 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 Fuck you, you old Asian piece <laughs> yeah, of yeah. shit. <laughs> Doesn't he look kind of look, look at it? Oh, he's going in the sky. Oh, he's staring right at an eclipse, and they tell you not to look at it, but yeah. there he is looking right at it. <laughs> These aren't the best photos of him. <laughs> the internet does this, man. Yeah. When you get older, they put up so many fucking rude photographs of you. Yeah, this is why you're supposed to die young, dude. Right. Marilyn Monroe is the best example. She died at 36 years old. There isn't a bad photo of the girl. And the guy, uh, the James Dean. James Dean. Oh yeah. Same guy. Yeah. yeah. Same thing. Steve McQueen. You know what I mean? There's no bad photos. So look up Steve McQueen. There's no bad photos of this fucking guy. It's imp when you die young, they can't take a bad photo of you. Mm. Look at that fucking guy, dude. He was like seventy there, no? No, he looks great. Dude. No, when did Steve McQueen die? Didn't he die young on the younger side? He died of cancer, right? When did he die? How old was uh, Steve McQueen? Mm -hmm. Fifty. Yeah, he's a young guy. Wow. That's young. Wow. As, that's young as shit. Fifty years old, man. Fifty so fucking young. That's What's so that? Young. He died in Juarez. Yeah, Juarez, Mexico, right? Wow. And yeah. in. Uh, you cannot, that. you cannot get a bad photo while you're 50. <laughs> you know what, dude? I know what you're fucking doing right now. I don't even He's know. targeting at you all day today. <laughs> you're tr are you talking? Look up Bobby Lee. See if there's any bad photos of him. You're trying to talk shit. Look at these images. Handsome, cute, cool, Handsome. funny, sharp. Okay. You look like Sarah Jessica Parker in that one picture. Yeah, you do. <laughs> cool shirt. Look at that, though. Not one bad photo, Andres. You jerk. You can't even tell the difference there between me and Steve. Well, you can a little bit. <laughs>
Yeah, good photos. So recant what you said. Take it back, Fancy, please. I was just asking. Here no, you. no, no. You know what you were doing. You were shooting oh. your shot. Uh, 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 honestly, honestly, dude, I, I would be real. And is I that was a gonna, I was going to fucking let it go, dude. What is your fucking problem with me today, dude? <laughs> I was going to let it go, but what the fuck is your problem with me today, dude? You've been attacking me since fucking I got, I got here. Yeah. I've only been nice to you. And also, can I say something? I've been giving you hugs, dude. Yeah, you ha he has been hugging women. Have I not been hugging you? Your fucking ugly pork body. Oh my god! Hey, be nice. We you look like a sea fly. No, <laughs> I don't know what sea. Shrimp shumai. <laughs> I don't know. You said shrimp shumai.